Okay, so let me f continue with the tour. So anyways, um, basically they are finishing up with the window cleaning in here. It's been quite a day. Huh? Oh, you can go out that. There's a door right there. Oh, thank you. <laughs> so, anyways, um, I showed you the living room earlier. This is a formal living room. So now we're going to go this direction, and we're going into. This is a powder room. It's dark. Oh my gosh. So this is a gorgeous powder room. I don't know if you can see it very well. It's gorgeous, great artwork. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you'll notice there's interesting designs. All the floors have amazing designs. So anyways, um, this is the family room area. You can see all that. This is the family room. This is where we hang out and watch TV and whatnot. Of course, this is the walkway from over here in the family room area over to the formal dining room. Sorry, I'm probably making you guys sick moving these cameras so fast. And then this is part of also the family room area and the bar area. And then of course in here is one of the kitchens. This is the, I guess I call it the clean kitchen. This is the kitchen that stays clean all the time because nobody cooks in it because it's just a pretty kitchen. And you see ladders everywhere, my housekeeper's cleaning. So that's the pretty kitchen. We call it the pretty kitchen. I'm gonna show you the dirty kitchen or the catering kitchen in a minute. Then of course over here, I also have my own salon. This is where we do our hair. So my daughter comes over and we do my hair in here. <laughs> Everybody has to have a salon in their house, right? Yeah! Anyways, kitchen area, awards, so on and so forth. Of course, this is a hallway. These are stairs that are gonna be going upstairs here shortly. But anyways, this is big, huge double doors that will go outside to the outdoor kitchen area. There's an outdoor kitchen, plus an outdoor living area out there. Then of course we go back here, and this is what I call my dirty kitchen. There's a phone ringing. Anyways, this is the catering kitchen. This is what I call my dirty kitchen because this is where I work, this is where we cook a lot, this is where the caterers always come when we're entertaining, so that's the catering kitchen, another great piece of art. And then we've got this amazingly beautiful bathroom in here. It's all done in black and white. I told you there's different designs all the time. Great steam shower. I'm gonna take you outside for just a second. I'm gonna show you outdoor kitchen area, but I wanna show you another bathroom. This is a pool bathroom out here. I added this on. This is a pool bath. This is where you come to change swimsuits and whatnot. But this is the outdoor area that I was telling you about. This is the outdoor living area. This is where we come to hang out, set out by the pool, watch great sunsets. We sit over here and watch TV. Of course, I carried my black and white theme outside also. Yep, really pretty chandeliers. So, anyways, so now you've seen pretty much all of the first floor of my house. So, here momentarily, we are going to be. Oh, there's the guy on the ladder still cleaning windows. <laughs> so, I hope so far you're enjoying these videos that I'm doing because I know I'm probably going kind of fast, but sorry, I'm trying to get as much in as I can for you guys to be able to see. And you're probably thinking, you know, why are you holding that thing so close to your face? I can see every wrinkle in your face. <laughs> Guess what, I don't care. 
don't care, don't care, don't care. Anyways, look at this beautiful, you, when, when I get up here, you're gonna be able to see this chandelier much, much, much better. Cause it's so pretty. I mean, look at this. That, that chandelier, can you see it? That chandelier, believe it or not, is six foot wide and 10 foot tall. Yeah, and I had it made in Egypt, along with the sconces. So anyways, we are up here on the second floor. Bear with me. Let me turn this around so you can see. There's my Mrs. Texas picture. <laughs> So this is one of the bedrooms upstairs. Everybody always likes to sleep in this bedroom because it has great views. Look at this, look at this. Da -da -da -da. Isn't that a great view? Hmm. Anyways, it's got pretty bathroom. I told you all the floors are different in this house. It's really pretty and I'm probably making you sick going so fast, moving this camera so fast. But anyways, um, this house, believe it or not, has nine bedrooms, 13 bathrooms. This is our grandchildren's playroom. So when you've got eight grandkids and we've got number nine and 10 being born in May or April, I think, um, they basically have to have their own playroom because with with ten grandkids, you know, what 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 do you what is, what's a girl to do? You gotta have, you know, girls and boys have to have their toys when they're at Grandma Grandpa's house. So we're gonna continue walking, walking, walking. Look at this. Ooh. Yeah. Wow. Wow. Yeah. There's my window washer, guys. There they are, there they are, there they are. So anyways, this up here is another family room. So you can see black and white portraits. This is another family room where we set upstairs. Everything is done in reds up here with black and white. We have another bar. This area over here is really cool because this part of the house has the best views anywhere. Look at this. Look at this. Is this not cool? Yeah. There's a window washer. There's a window washer guy. <laughs> Anyways, great views. Great views from up here. It's fantastic. This is probably one of my favorite rooms in the whole entire house. I just love it up here. But anyways, this is on the second floor. Uh-huh. And yeah, there's stairs. We're gonna be going to, to level number three here momentarily. And over here, of course, is another bathroom. And of course, you're gonna see that it has another different kind of floor. See, all the floors are different everywhere. All the floors are different. Anyways, now, I don't know if you really wanna see the other bedrooms, I doubt it, but, um, and here is the media room. Media room, media room. Yep, this is the media room. It's quite large. It's very large, actually, Donald Duck. It's extremely large. This is where we hang out a lot, a lot. But anyways, I'm not going to bore you with the other bedrooms on this floor. There's uh, two more bedrooms on this floor. Um, but it's a big house. Just the, just the first floor alone is like 7,200 square feet. I think the second floor is over 6,000 square feet. And then of course the third floor is like somewhere around the same. But anyways, I'm just gonna shoot. This is uh, another bedroom. All the bedrooms have their own private bathrooms. Um, so it's fun, it's cool and there's one more going this way. Yes, so this is another really pretty bedroom with beautiful views. It's, it's got its own bathroom. Anyways, that is 
video number two. So with that said, um, I will be shooting the third floor momentarily. Hang on. Okay, so we are getting ready to go to floor number three in this house. Basically up here, I think we've got like four bedrooms or something like that. Anyways, up here, I know before I've showed you my fitness room. This is my gym up here on the third floor. This is where I spend a lot of time working out, having fun, doing all that kind of thing, yes. Yeah, it's got its own bathroom. Of course, my fitness closet with all my fitness clothes. I know I'm giving you guys like speedy tour, but really, you don't want to be bored going room from room. And of course, all of my lights are not on. But anyways, this is on the third floor. This is the library partial kitchen. In here, sometimes my twin grandsons like to come and hang out with grandma. So you'll notice that these two bedrooms have everything matching. It's got a Jack and Jill bathroom. Voila, see, matching, <laughs> matching. The twins have to have everything the same, I swear to God, I swear to God. And then you can see, I don't know if you can see really well or not, but also out there, there is a lake behind me. So not only am I on the eighth tee box on this golf course, but I also have a beautiful lake in the back. So it's it's stunning. It's really pretty here, really pretty. Sometimes people are like, well, how can you not live inside of Houston? Like, why don't you live in Houston? Well, when you've lived out here and been in this beauty, it's, it's really hard to go back to the city sometimes. In here is my spa room. This is where I indulge you know I've got all my facial stuff my massage all my stuff everything that my facialist and my masseuse need is in this room so this is my pamper room this is where I pamper myself mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and then of course in here is another master so this is my like third floor master so Really pretty. This is where I make my husband sleep when he's being bad. No, <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> Anyways, so this is another master up here. So <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> no, this is where guests stay. This is sometimes my husband will come up here and sleep when there's just too much commotion going on downstairs. But anyways, I hope you guys have enjoyed this really extreme fast tour. I thought I was going to have to do it in three different clips, but I think I managed to do it in, in two, part twos. So, you know, already got part one, here's part two. So, with that said, I hope I didn't make you too sick by going too fast, um, but I wanted to try to give you an overall look of what my house looks like. So, I think one of my next videos is going to be doing uh, a q and A. I I think I would love to be able to get you all to try to find me on Snapchat and throw some questions at me so that I can answer them on YouTube. Ask me any kind of question you want and I will answer you. So with that said, you've kind of gotten a little sneak peek into my Teresa Romer world at my house. It's very big. It uh, takes a lot of work. Um, and I only have one full-time housekeeper. <laughs> yeah, so that's a miracle in itself, but she does stay busy. So with that said, I hope you guys have enjoyed these videos that I've done. Look at how pretty it is. See the, see the fountains? Mm-hmm, beautiful. So with that said, I hope you all have a great, great week. I know I am. And uh, let's, let's think about doing the Q&A. I know there's a lot of questions out there y'all would like to know about me. Um, and I will be happy to answer you. So I hope you guys can put up with these no makeup days because I truly, I truly, truly like not wearing makeup. 
um, I'm not out to impress anyone. So, anyways, I guess me and Alicia Keys, you know, we, neither one of us like to wear makeup. <laughs> so, anyways, hope you have a good week and make sure you tell your friends to subscribe. I mean, we've got some amazing videos lined up for you guys. So, it's, it's gonna just get even more fun as time goes on. Subscribe!